Hey everybody, this is William again, and I am doing another video to show off some of the cool features of the Galaxy Note 3, as well as the Galaxy Gear. Um, right then and there, you just saw all I did was pick it up and the display turned on. That is a cool feature, um, the accelerometer in it. Um, when you're just, you know, when your your wrist is just, um, just laying there, just not, you're not using your watch at all, it, you're able to just, and then when you, um, bring it up, it can tell, um, when you're just like that, it, you know, the, the motion, the accelerometer senses, you're moving it, you know, to a position where you would most likely, you know, be looking at it. So it turns it on, and then, you know, if you just, like that, the screen dims and then turns off. Um, so that's a really cool feature. Um, let's see, let's start with this. Um, if you see right here, um, I have, you can do many different clocks. But I currently have one where it shows, you know, the the time, the date, uh, you know, the day, and then it has shortcuts on here. So click, oh, yeah, I'll just press the button. Pedometer. There's a pedometer right there. Um, today, um, I have taken two thousand, oh, two thousand, oh, let me. I have the setting to where it turns off pretty quickly. Um, nope, wrong one. There we go. 2,570. 1.1 mile, 106 calories burned. Um, I can go there. Goal, 10,000. I can, you know, change that to whatever I want to do. I can reset it. I can send it to S Health, which I guess that's the Galaxy Note. Uh, three Samsung's app, whatever feedback I have it checked, so I guess it sends feedback to Samsung so they know what to do. Um, or I reset help, so whatever. Um, let's go back to the home, then S voice. So I can say text mom. Hey, I'm doing a video. This is a test. Test text message. So, this is just a test. Here is your message. Ready to send it. I didn't catch that. No. Click it again. No. Okay, I won't send it. Okay, so, you know, it test, text, you know, you gotta really be, those words sound kind of similar, so, it, you know, and I wasn't speaking the most clearly, um, so, but, you know, you can do stuff like, um, you know, check schedule, or, you know. Check schedule. I've been on event in your schedule. I don't have any events in my schedule, so that's you know, but you know, it shows it it does it. Um it, there's modes where you can um also shoot, you know, shoot the video, you know, shoot by saying like shoot, cheese, smile, whatever, stuff like that. Um let's go back to camera. It's got a 1.9 megapixel camera, I think, 1.9 or 2, whatever, and it also has seven, up to 720p video. It can only record for 15 seconds right now. That kind of sucks. Um, I'm hoping that the app developer, the developing community can get that changed, you know, do some, root it or something like that and get it changed, but for the most part, um, oh, let me go. 
Uh, oh, there we go. Uh, take a picture. So, oops, let's just go to, you go back to camera. Ah, uh, it's kind of hard to see through the, the lens, but, yep, see. I took a picture of the um, Audacity stream because I'm recording separate audio because the, you know, just so it's better, better audio than the mic on my camera or camcorder, even though my camcorder is pretty nice, but I want better audio because my mic's, you know, whatever. Um, oh, here's a video I took at the supermarket. Um... I'll probably show that video in this video. I'll probably put it in there so you probably either just saw it or you're about to see it or whatever. Um, let's quickly go back to do contacts. You can see all your contacts and stuff like that. Logs, apps, S voice, pedometer, media controller, so you can control um, your music and stuff like that from your phone. I think um, I haven't tested that out yet, but um, Evernote, that's an app you have to download through the few apps that are out on the market right now. Voice memo. Um, remember to do a video review on the Galaxy Note 3. You got it. Um, be sent to mobile device. So, you know, it's sent to the mobile device. Um, this has 4 gigs of memory on it, or 4 gigs of storage on it. Um, I think it's 512 gigs of I don't I don't remember. It it's not the best. This is pretty much um it's like an 800 megahertz processor and I think maybe 5 maybe uh half a gig, you know, 512 MB of RAM. I I'm I think I could be wrong, but it's pretty much on par with how original Android phones were when they first launched um way back in 2008 or 2009? Not exactly. But let's go back to pedometer, media controller, Evernote, voice memo, gallery, um, cam dictionary. Uh, that's an app I downloaded. I haven't tried that out yet, so um, I'll test that out and then try to maybe put that on another video. Um, tweet quick view. You can check your Twitter settings notification so um let's see in, let's let's quickly go back to uh apps see I mean, if you go to apps you can see the apps you know stopwatch timers today's schedule settings tweet view weather voice memo archive cam dictionary camera contacts all that so um what's really cool is um I don't really misplace my phone per se, but I do know people who do. Um, one person is my mother who really who misplaces her phone a lot. So um, let me just make sure this. Uh, and another cool feature is when your Galaxy Gear. Is a you can set it to where you, when your Galaxy Gear is away from your um because when if you see right here all I gotta do is swipe to unlock but if your Galaxy Gear is away from your phone it you know set automatically locks your phone so you have to do you know a pattern or whatever so bam unlocks so that's really cool um let me just turn 
that I don't want to blow out the audio, um, but, oops, let's see, oh, apps, find my device, start, oh, so, it kind of was a bit loud, but, you know, it, it'll make your, it'll make your device blare so you can find it. You know, um, if you don't have a friend or someone around who can call it, you can just click it, and you can do the you can do vice versa with the with the the phone to the gear where you can have the gear ring, or the the smartwatch ring. So that's something there. Um, if you let's see, if I go quickly down to Galaxy Gear settings, um, I named mine Will's Gear because that's my name, William Will. Um, Clocks. You can switch the different clocks that style out. You can have. Let me put this down. You can have um, weather clock, shortcut, shortcut clock, which is what I have. Pedometer clock, um, event clock, dual clock. So maybe you know you can have it set to um, you know my. I can have it set to my time, and then if I have say maybe if I have a friend who or a family member who lives, like, you know, I don't know, say in uh, Japan, I could have that time set so I know what time it is there. Um, uh, let's see, digital clock, analog clock, blah, 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 blah. Um, shortcut clock, you can click, you can change. Um, the only text colors on this one are white and orange. I have orange because, you know, it's orange and black. Um, let's see. Because, you know, it's Halloween, it, or it's October, so Halloween's around, um, so that's Halloween colors, but you can change the different stuff, you know, I have camera, S-voice, and pedometer, but if I want to do that, I could change it to find my device, um, you know, stuff like that, so, um, let's see, pedometer, change it back, um, let's go back real quick. Back. Um, Samsung apps. There's not a wide variety of stuff right now. Entertainment. You know, there's quick spin the bottle pocket for Samsung, which I think that's. What is pocket for Samsung? Um, I think it's like a note. A note taking app type thing or something. I don't know. Um, let's go back. Uh, Radio on for Galaxy Gear, quick dice. So I guess you know if you need a if you need a dice to roll for something. I don't know if you play, you know, tabletop games or something like that. That's kind of cool. Um, health and fitness. There's My Fitness Pal, which you know whatever Runtastic for Samsung, quick speed meter, um, lifestyles. You know there's an Evernote app, Path, which, um, that's like a, I think it's a social network type app, um, eBay, uh, a couple others, uh, there's an app, for, you use the camera to scan, like, wine, and it tells you, like, which wine is good for pairing with fish and stuff like that, Snapchat, um, that's, that's, you know, you're able to send pictures to people, and, it lasts for certain seconds. Um, let's see. Yeah, not much else. Um, you know, a few different clocks. Um, I like to. I, I'm looking forward to seeing more apps come. Um, from what I've heard, that it's not. It's not too difficult to tweak the code. Um, from what I've. From a couple sources I've read and looked up, it's not that different to tweak the code to change um to you know for an app to work work for the gear um some apps you have to have the app for the phone and the gear um like the evernote app you have to have both apps some you just have to have it for the gear um you know find my gear i can click that um let's see my apps you can change the settings um 
auto lock. That's the one I was telling you about when your gear is gone. It locks your phone, notifications, you know, double press the power button. You can choose different apps to, to start up, you know, if you, if you want, if you double click and you want, you know, say, you know, that was the S voice, but if you want a timer or stopwatch or, you know, maybe pedometer or find your device, whatever, um, Cam dictionary. Right here, you can change different notifications. Um, Gmail. Uh, Gmail, you can't, I, I don't think you can, for right now, Gmail doesn't work too well with it. I mean, I don't think you can see the whole messages, um, but the workaround is to set under the email section to set it that up, your Gmail and that. Um, wake up gestures, when you raise your arm, the gear turns on. You can turn that off if you want. I like to have it on. Um, let's see. Back. Um, but yeah, the Galaxy Gear, it's... I like it, personally. I really do. It's a nice device. Um, you can make calls on it um, because there there's a mic on it and uh, right here there's a speaker, which it sounds pretty good. It really does. I really think it's it's great. Um, of course, you're not gonna want to um, use it to call. If I mean, if you, if you, if it's important calls and you're out in public, maybe not. But if you know, if it's you know, you just want to, if you're if you're like maybe out at the park or something like that, away from people, and you know, it's not a real important conversation you can talk or if you're in the car that that's something I can see being very useful you know um, also you when you I have it set up to where when someone calls me I can say accept you know and it'll answer on the watch or I could say reject and you know it obviously it will decline the call and reject it but that's really cool because if like like I'm driving you know, I can't exactly pick up my phone if my phone's like in my pocket or on the passenger seat or whatever. So, you know, my hands are on the steering wheel. So my watch would be, you know, like right here. So I could just be like, oh, let me put the watch on real quick. Um, this is going to be a longer, long video, but you know, whatever. Um, you know, if I'm driving and I say accept, and then I can just take the call and not, and you know, just talk how I, you know, talk normally, and, you know, it's, it's a great Bluetooth accessory, you know, whether it's worth the two ninety nine price tag, I don't know, um, originally, I wasn't planning on picking this up, you know, it was not in my realm of, you know, possibilities, I was just like, no, I'm not picking it up, I don't see what the point is, but, you know, it was presented to me, so I was just like, uh, okay, you know, sure, I'll take one. Um, I mean, not to say this was free, but, you know, I was given this. Um, but, you know, it's it's a neat device, and I'm sure Samsung, you know, it just came out. You know, it's, like, not even a, mo a month old, just a week or two old. Um, so, I'm sure Samsung will release some updates for it, um, hopefully. Uh, as you can see, I'm doing this video at 10:47 at night on Wednesday, October 16th. So you know, y'all, if, if this video comes out like you know next Monday, y'all can be like, oh wow, it took him long to edit this. But hopefully, this will be out on Thursday. Um, so it's I like it. I really do. It's a cool device. Um, you know, I can check. You know, if you have your if you have your phone in your pocket. And you don't want to be too rude when you're around people and, um, you know, pull it out and ignore them or whatever. And you get a text message or something. You can just, you know, just talk to them and just, you know, just easily just, you know, check the message and read it or whatever. Um, you, you know, and if you're driving and you get a message, you, you know, you can quickly, you know, tap on it and then. You know, um, there's S reply or S voice for reply, so you can, you know, speak to text like, you know, I showed y'all that. Um, 
I showed y'all the S voice where you send the message and all that. So, um, like I said, I'm glad I have this device, you know. Um, the one thing I kind of don't like about it, um, and I'm going to do a m full review on the website, um, with, you know, picture tests and, you know, a written review, a full written review, so check that out, thegeeksftw.com, uh, but as you see, there's pins on the back, there's no way to charge this without the cradle, um, you click that, and then right there is the micro U micro USB port. Um, so that's you know it kind of sucks because if you want if you're traveling with your Galaxy Note three and you want to have fast you know want to have the fast charge using the uh US micro USB three point port, you're gonna have to bring two chargers because you know that is this is not compatible with this charger but this is compatible with this charger if you know cuz you know the micro usb port is right you know if i cover that up that's a regular micro usb port but you know you add this section this second part to it and it's the usb 3.0 part um this is a longer video than i thought but you know pretty much shown it off um i'm going to i know i've been seeing that there's ways to cuz right now there's just you know there's no real you know legal or not legal but you know easy way samsung provided to you know change the ringtones or notification tones um sound there's only 3 per you know you can have touch on if you want um you know, you can have change the sound mode, you know, to where it vibrates or whatnot. Um, you know, notifications. There's three notifications, and there's three ringtones. But you know, and you can change which arm preference you want it on, and it adjusts the mic accordingly. Um, but there's no you know way to put any customized sounds on it. Um, I've tried. I've been able to put custom sounds on it using a program I found online, but unfortunately it put some other stuff on the phone on, on the smartwatch and I didn't feel comfortable with that, so I, you know, I reset it. Um gear or reset gear. Reset gear that you saw it, but um I reset it and so far it's default. I'm going to I'm trying to look up to see because, you know, I'm a geek. I want the Morpher communicator tone, you know, the do 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 to, you know, play for the notifications for this. And, you know, for the ringtone, I don't know, something. I'll figure something out. Um, but yeah, that's my review of the, you know, so far of the Galaxy Gear. Um, you know, it's it's a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Um, I like it. I feel cool wearing it because it, you know, it, it looks, it, it's, it's, you know, it's a geek thing. It's definitely a cool geek thing, you know. It's gotten, it's nice build. It looks just, it looks amazing, you know. You can feel the, you can see the chrome finish. Um, you know, it's definitely me metal. Um, it's a hard, the band is a hard silicone. It doesn't feel that, it really doesn't feel bad, and, you know, of course, this part, the clamp, um, has the speaker, and you just, uh, so, and just clip on, um, camera right there, um, so, and, uh, it's, as of right now, there's no way to be pervy with it, which is kind of cool, um, because, I mean, you know, that's what a lot of people are going to maybe use this as unfortunately since it has the camera to take pictures of people or in you know when they're not supposed to or whatever whatever but it has the shutter sound whenever you take a picture of it so that's that's definitely good um you know i i know eventually there will probably be stuff ways to turn that off but what you know for right now it's you know it's good um you know this is 300 bucks right now um 
my prediction is on Black Friday they may have um, you know get the Galaxy Note 3 and get the smartwatch free or you know get it half off or something like that or some so something they're gonna have something going on um, unfortunately you know there are different colors you can get I just got black because you know it's you know it it black is just a good all-around color to have you know matches with everything pretty much and plus it matches with my phone um, but you know it's it's definitely it's definitely something different and like I said it's a good accessory it's a good accessory to have you know at least I think so anyways um if you like the video you know of course like it you know click the little thumbs up button subscribe you know we're trying to I'm trying I'm gonna do a lot more tech stuff and other you know other videos outside of gaming um, and if people if people like them more, then I'm gonna we we can do our own separate channel for tech and stuff like that. So you know, leave comments, let me know. You know, if you like the tech stuff, if you like the tech stuff, if you'd like the tech talk and stuff like that to be you know different from the main channel where it's gaming, tech, and you know, so far that's all we're really doing is gaming and tech stuff. Um, I'm going to be doing more stuff. I sh should have a video going over, you know, the Galaxy Note 3 a bit in depth. Um, this video was pretty much just showing off the, even though I did show some stuff on the Galaxy Note 3, it was the feature it dealt with the Galaxy Gear. So, um, you know, with that, and, and, and just so you know, the Galaxy Gear has Bluetooth on it, um, accelerometer, gyroscope uh, it does not it connects to the phone Bluetooth to be able to um, access the internet and stuff like that so it does not require a data plan at all um, it's you know 299 straight up you know you can buy it you know straight up by itself you don't you can buy it from you know other places I see like AT&T on their website they have like a rose gold color you know, band. I guess that'd be good for females. So you could get that. They have yellow. They have orange. I think green, mocha. You know, oatmeal beige, which I think is just like a fancy term for white. But you know, they're all gonna work. I mean, they're all they're just because you get one from AT and T, it'll work on you know the Verizon or one from T Mobile. It'll work on the Ver you know the Verizon of phone of course or you know vice versa and all that stuff so um once again you know this has been a lengthy video but you know hey you know it's I wanted to show off the cool stuff with this um there's other features and stuff that I probably haven't gotten around to looking at so um I mean I've only had this device for let's see Less than a week, actually. So, you know, it's Wednesday. I got this on Saturday. Um, you know, didn't get to do much with it on Saturday. Um, so, you know, been messing with it since then. Um, but I love it. It's a great device. So, you know, um, let's get that back up while I'm talking. But, you know, it's... It, it's a great device, and I'm going to stop saying that because I'm just rambling right now. But, you know, like like the video, subscribe, leave comments, feedback is greatly appreciated because, you know, I'm new at doing this. And I'm just thrilled that my uh, Galaxy Note 3 unboxing video got, it, it almost has 100 views right now. So, you know, that may not seem like a lot to most people, but, you know, our channel, we're pretty mu we pretty much don't get much. I mean my Galaxy Gear unboxing, which I admit was pretty weak because I didn't really show off anything but the unboxing and show off the device. I didn't even turn it on or show the screen or nothing like that. So I admit that was kind of weak, but you know, that only has like 30 something views. But anyways, I am going to um, end this video and stay, you know, subscribe because there will be more videos to come. So 
Thank you very much. Oh, oh yeah, I can see where this would be fun. I just hit somebody. I can see where this would be fun with weapons. Oh, I'm oh, oh shit, I hit. You hit people. Can I, can I get...